With great blessings come great responsibility. Hey guys, it's me again, Douglas. And today I wanted to talk to you guys about responsibility. Yeah, and being responsible means means taking care of what you are in charge of. And I don't know about you, but I really hate waking up in the mornings, right? You know, there's just so much stuff to do before you go to school or before you go to church. You know, you got to wake up early so you don't miss the bus and you got to, you know, take a bath or a shower or whatever. And, and then you got to have your breakfast and you got to brush your teeth and then you got to get dressed and you got to get everything ready for school and then you got to go to school. And that's just, that's just getting ready. That doesn't even cover all the stuff you got to do all day long. You know, you got to do your homework. You got to take care of your dog. You got to do your chores. You got to do all this stuff. So much stuff. And it was starting to get really bad in the mornings because it was, it was just really starting to get to the point where I was just not listening to my alarm clock. And so my alarm clock would go off and i just ignore that. And then my mom would have to come and like drag me out of bed. And I'm just laying there like a jellyfish, just like, oh, I don't want to get up. And then one day she had just, she had just had enough. And she said to me, she said, Douglas, it's time for you to count your blessings. And I was like, what? She was like, I mean it, count your blessings. And I was like, what, what do you mean? And she said, literally, count your blessings. What are some of the things that God has given you that he has blessed you with? And I started thinking, and man, I, it did not take me very long to have a very, very, very long list. I kept going so long, I was, I was pretty worried we were going to be late for school. And my mom explained to me that just about everything that I've got to do, all the responsibilities that I have, are because of a blessing that God has given me. All that stuff I got to do in the morning, you know, getting up early and brushing my teeth and, and, you know, getting my clothes on, all this stuff, all this stuff is because of blessings that God has given me. And one of the best ways to tell God that you are thankful for what he's given you is to take good care of it, to be responsible with it. Who do you think gave you your brain? Yeah, God did. And God wants you to take care of it. And going to school gives your brain the, the food and the exercise that it needs to grow and be healthy. You know, God gave you your teeth. And so brushing your teeth every day is a good way to take care of what God has given you. You know, my dog Roscoe, is a, is, he's a lot of work. I got to clean up after him. I got to feed him. I got to take him on walks. But I love my dog. He's such a good dog. And, you know, it's interesting because I'll bet that everybody out there would say, oh, man, I would really love more blessings in my life. But with more blessings comes more responsibilities. And I don't want you to take this next part as meaning that God is like some kind of vending machine. Because you can't make God do stuff. But the Bible does say that if you are responsible with a little amount, God will give you more. I think that's super cool. But it is a lot of responsibility. So my challenge to you guys today is I want you to look at the stuff in your life that seems like a lot of work. And I want you to look at those things and I want you to count the blessings around those things. I got to wake up early so that I can take care of my teeth, which God gave me. And I can have my breakfast, which God gave me. And I can put on my clothes, which God gave me. So that then I can get on the bus, which, you know, God has blessed me with the fact that my family is on the bus route on the way to school. And then I got to go to school, which God has blessed me with a free education. How cool is that? So that I can feed and exercise my brain, which God gave me. God has given us so, so much. And one of the best ways that we can thank him for what he's given us is to be responsible. Hey guys, I hope you liked this video. And man, one of the huge blessings of our time is the internet. How cool is it that you and I can, you know, spend time together like we are right now and we don't even have to be in the same state or even the same country. But yeah, you know, the internet is a huge blessing, but it's also a huge responsibility. It can even be very dangerous. And so if you're watching this video by yourself, you know, if you're a kid and you're not watching with your family or with your teacher or whoever, it's very, very important that you are responsible and that you always have a parent's permission to do anything you do online. Even if I tell you, you know, go to douglastalks.com, or if I say go to patreon.com slash douglastalks, or any, anything, even if I tell you to do something, it's very important that you never do anything on the internet without your parent's permission. Using the internet is a huge blessing, but it's also a huge responsibility. So always make sure that you have your parent's permission before you do anything online.